Well, they are not knocking the D2 National Wrestling Championship anymore because now Kamaru Usman has some UFC gold to go with it. A huge effort to dethrone Tyron Woodley not all that long ago, and now Usman's got that target on his back. And he also has an undying belief in himself. He believes that through all the hard work, the result will show when he steps in the octagon. He has underrated striking. And because everyone fears his wrestling, a lot of his striking opportunities open up even more. But the moment Usman grabs you, he can control you in a way that not many guys in the UFC can. We saw that in the Woodley fight. We saw it in the Dos Anjos fight. That's why he is the best fighter at 170 pounds. And when your bout agreement says Kamaru Usman on it, get ready for Grab a lunch pill. Grab a lunch pill! <laughs> Might need a helmet, too, if that's allowed. Kamaru Usman getting ready to go here tonight. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight, but there aren't that many guys who are gonna wanna stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Or tail of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. So two years, the gap in age, some differences in height and reach. Here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC Heavyweight Division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a wrestler, holding a professional record of 20 wins, three losses. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting at a Boca Raton, Florida, Kamaru, the Nigerian Nightmare, Usman. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee! You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves as make it as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the tank. All right, early round one, we'll see if he can use that jab and try to keep his opponent on the outside. Must be nice for these long fighters, huh? I mean, they are able to touch you as you try to enter into range. Tonight, he needs to use his jab, use his kicks to hit his opponent before his opponent can get into range to even start to think about striking. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. 
big ball from punch land. Now he gets back to range. Oh, and there's that head kick. He kept talking about the opening that would be there on Thursday. Those words proven prophetic right there. I mean, his vision and his timing allows him to get that technique off. Some nice power there with the left hook upstairs. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. How good is that right hand? Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Three minutes remain in the round. A lot of power on display from Kamar Usman as he lands yet again there. Kamar Usman showed in the Kobe Covington fight. Not only is he the best welterweight in the world, he may just be the toughest welterweight in the world because he went through the fire in order to retain that title. Usman gets caught with that punch. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Oh, he lands another shot to the head. Topping his shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very accurate. Oh, that straight punch was useful, champ. Multiple times he's used this punch to get to the target. Big leg kick lands. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one? Went inside on that leg kick through the jab left hook and went inside. Usually, you know, you see guys throw the outside kick there. That was nice. Look at him whip his hips into that kick. Oh, trying to turn out the lights with that roundhouse kick, but just misses. Well, if you're going to leave your body that wide open, you're going to pay the price, and he certainly did there as his opponent lands flush to the midsection. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. 36 total strikes have landed for Kamaru Usman. Beautiful body. Oh, wow, those leg kicks are already taking effect. Ooh, big shot lands. Clipped him with the right hand there. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. Well, really using his reach advantage there with that punch, DC. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Another shot lands upstairs. Nice loop punch. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. And both guys really throwing with authority. And he landed the right hand there. Usman's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Five minutes in the books. All right, well, his kicking game was outstanding in that round. We'll see if his opponent can make the adjustments, but take us through the replays before we get there. It's always weird to watch a young fighter start to come into his own. Early in his career, he did not have this ability. He did not have the ability to dictate and control fights with his legs. Now he does, and he looks like a future champion in the making. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this He round. doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Ooh, what a punch. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Oh, 
Oh, he got that inside leg kick to the target there, DC. You don't want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. It starts to beat up the inside side. That is a technique you use to really slow down your opponent. Big kick. Lee gets hit with that hook. That one had some pop behind it. Oh, how about that? He lands a huge kick. Ooh, looking to go to the leg kick here, just out of range. Usman gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. Very nice leg kick there by Usman. Blocks that kick to the body. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, oh. no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the <laughs> whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Beautiful punch. Just over three minutes now to go in round two. Well, the body work starting to take its toll. Look at the redness starting to appear on his left side. Oh, really exploiting his reach advantage as he landed the jab there, DC. Lee's kick, that one blocked. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Well, no surprises, he connects once again, and that looked like it landed right on that cut. Right on the cut, and he's targeting it, right? He's looking, you can see him almost putting a laser beat on that cut and just putting his hands on it. It doesn't take much, he just keep making it split, showing his opponent that he has the mercy. going for the head kick, no dice. Oh man, his leg kicks are outstanding and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see as the opponent starting to slow down, he cannot take many of those kicks. Well, DC, no denying he's winning this fight and it's gotta feel pretty good if you're a fighter and you put in the work and it all comes together. It all comes together, nothing feels better. Go out there and implement the game plan that you guys have worked on in training camp and it goes as desired, nothing goes back. Ooh, head kick lands and he's hurt. Nice punch by Lee. Right hand on the counter is true. Trump. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize the fucking high, and now he's got hurt bad. Oh man, that left side is getting beat up now. Look at the redness there. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Lee gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. Certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you gotta like the output on display here. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Effective strike there by Usman. Oh, combination lands, and it seemed like almost every strike found the target. He's so accurate when he decides to attack. It is a sight to behold. Nice hit, landed that left hook. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Right hand upstairs. Powerful leg kick land. All right, that's the end of round number two. All right, so that's the end of the round. The cut on the cheek is only getting worse. Thankfully, it is below the eye and not above it, but still a source of adversity for him here. All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC, and I'd imagine a lot of these replays are gonna be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're gonna see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight.
He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets under. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Lands the right hand. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Came of inches right there, Damn. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Look at the turtle in that kick. Usman's lower jaw very swollen now. Time to bite down on the mouthpiece and move forward. Nice body kick. Now he's got that tie clinch. We'll see what he can do with it. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Oh, spinning back fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. There's no tell on that leg. Both kick. fighters exchange in the pocket here. Back to the leg kick now. That one's no good. Oh, man. This is one thing you do not want to get kicked in the head in MMA. You cannot take too many of those head kicks, but this guy gets his leg up there so fast, sometimes you don't see it coming. Just over three minutes to go in round three. Really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. Just out of range with that right hook. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. Nice little kickboxing exchange there from the welterweight champ, Kamara Usman. Usman's another one of those guys that came in as a wrestler, has turned into a great striker, which has led him to become the UFC champion. Oh, he landed a beautiful straight punch there. Oh, he's oh, oh, the spot. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. Trying to stay in this fight! Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. Big kick lands. Back and forth we go! Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Just misses with the left hook. Gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Liver kick. If you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. Nice punch there by Lee. Big power shot there. And he lands yet another hook there. Flush. Nice job by Kamaru Rus. He blocks the shot. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Slips the punch nicely there. Oh, man, hate to be hit with one of those knees to the body. Oh! Just missed on the front kick there. Nice job there to land the knee strike to the body again, making great use of his length in this matchup. Oh, 
on, he connects there. His hands look good to me. So fast. I mean, this guy... the end of the round, a stunner there with the head strike midway through, nearly got him out of there for good. Almost got him out of there. He hurt him badly. He had his opponent hurt real bad. Now his opponent's walking back to his corner. Everybody looks confused. They don't know what they're supposed to do to try to change the way that this fight is going. All right, so next round underway here, and you got to admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a particular focus on their cardiovascular commitment in this training camp, and it's clearly paid dividends here tonight. We have two legitimately fresh fighters here as we hit this next round. Well, the right hand has been there at times, not that time. Well, just as he did the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Usman's kick to the body is blocked. Effective punch there by Lee. Would you look at the size of that bruise on his body? His opponent will likely continue to attack. You gotta check. leg kick thrown. Nice connection on the counter punch there, and oftentimes DC can be easier to be a counter striker when you have such a pronounced counter This fight's gonna be over this time. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the court. He mixed it up. He went high with his opponent, but he was going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Well-placed kick there by Lee. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Oh, and he lands another knee there, DC. He talked a lot to us about his length and his size advantage. Doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it certainly did. Nice punch here. Oh, buckled him there. Beautiful shot to the body. Checks that leg kick. Changes his stance. You'll see a lot of this from this fighter. Under three minutes remain in round four. Visibly limping here. Nice technique on the sidekick. Big body kick. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Oh, there he goes, attacking that lead leg to the outside. Nasty kick. There. Nasty leg kick. You gotta slow down your opponent. He knew his opponent wanted to move a lot tonight. This is the first step. It's getting him to slow down and fight at your pace. Can't take many of those. You better check. Oh, big right hand, yes. Loaded up on that right hand, too. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Oh, and he countered him there with a beautiful straight right hand. Looking to land the leg kick now. Oh, that's a good right hand. Usman gets hit with a kick. Going for the leg kick. Nothing doing there. Blocks the strike. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Nice head kick. You can 
really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. He gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Looking to set up a knee of his own. Right hand upstairs. Nice kick. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Oh. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Well, that's the end of the round, so the location is okay, the cut on the cheek, but that is some serious blood trickling out of that cut there. You gotta think maybe at some point they call the doctor in, and if he doesn't like what he sees, maybe they stop this fight. All right, so there's the end of the round. Few things in MMA more devastating than a head kick and nearly produced a knockout for him there. We talked to him earlier in the week, and he talked about chances to take the kicks high. He got a chance, he took it, he landed that kick and almost got the fight finished. Let's see if he can go and do that again. Fifth and final round. Oh, that's a good knee to the body there by me. Well, he's always on the counter attack, but a nice leg kick there by us. Beautiful strike. The guard lands the right hand. Shot to the body, turned back by Lee. Beautiful kick. Tags him with the left. So the taller fighter lands a knee, and Daniel Cormier to my right, I can hear him saying, I wish I was a little bit taller. Big leg kick land. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh, and he caught the kick. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand, just out of range. Punch coming, it's blocked. Real quick leg kick. Oh, nice jab there. He told us on Thursday he wanted to break this dude's nose. That is certainly a step in the right direction. Mission accomplished. <laughs> you are battering that nose. Kick to the body now. That one won't land. Dig and kick. All right, so a good job by him here. He continues to block these shots. Seems to see them coming a mile away. He sees them coming a mile away, and he's blocking, he's rolling, he's slipping. He's doing a great job. Ooh! Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Usman gets caught with that punch. Obvious redness on the right side of his body. All right, late in the fight now, he needs a finish or he's gonna lose this fight tonight. We'll see if he goes for it. I mean, he's gotta pull out all the stops. There is no more strategy. There is no more time to try to set up a punch. You gotta just start letting everything fly. Let's go. Try to establish that jab. Big kick lands. There's no give on that leg kick. And he's able to work his way back to his feet. Bushman gets caught with that punch. That was a thudding leg kick. Got clipped with the right hand. Oh. Big kick. Oh. Oh. And now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it. It was coming high. And now he's got a hurt bad. Nice kick. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Oh. Missed with that attempt. 
huge knee lands from Oh, looked like that one counted. Nice head kick. He blocks the punch. Nice leg kick lands. Oh, lands a stiff punch there. Nice connection. Oh, nice lands. Well, at this point, the fight is way up on the judges' scorecards, and from a stamina standpoint, he looks like he can fight all night. He does a fantastic job of fighting at a great pace, but also knowing exactly where. Oh! He's hurt bad times. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, and he's back up again. Those get-ups have been there for him all night. Here's the kick blocked by Usman. That's a big strike right there. Still nice body kick lands. 20 seconds to go in the fight. Oh, big left hand there. can you say, but what a fight. decision is in, Bruce Buffer has it. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest, 50-45. Clearing the winner by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee! All right, so the judges are in agreement tonight. He is your winner by unanimous decision. Certainly pretty easy fight to score, I thought. Yeah, I thought it was an easy fight to score. Whereas his opponent had a few moments, he was the one that truly 